and let it look like a shadow. Okay, we're going to put this around your neck. This is the programmer. You probably should have brought something to put your hair on. I guess I had. We're good. I'll just move her hair around, you know. How's that feel? Like there's something in my ear. Yep, pretty much. <laughs> Are you recording me? I am. Hey. Yeah, just pull it out of the way for me for this part. You over there making me think she gonna cut me. Gosh, Mom. I couldn't help it. Me too. This is so exciting. It is. You won't have to do all this. I just have to stretch that tubing so it'll fit on my ear hook. Now when I put this in your ear, it is not yet tuned to your hearing loss. So don't, okay. Don't freak out when I can't hear anything. Or it's too loud or whatever. I don't know if it can be too loud. <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and tell you this. This all fits down in here, but you got to tuck that little piece up in there like that, okay? Okay. We'll work on that. You can put your hair down now. All right, I'm going to connect up to it, and then we'll do some programming, okay? All right. Do I look like I have a hearing aid in my ear? No. Mm-mm. Does it matter? Does it come with batteries? Mm-hmm. Are the batteries expensive to replace? Nope. How long do they last? Seven to ten days. Really? Yes. Will it like beep and tell me that it's dead? Yes. Seven to ten days? That's it? Honey, this is a little computer you're wearing. It uses some juice. Wow. Okay. It's not like a watch battery. It looks like a watch battery, but it doesn't function like one. Wow. I think they're less than a dollar a piece. It's not going to break the Oh, money. nice. Yeah. It's not like some super duper specialty battery. Bro, I can hear her. Yeah, pretty cool, huh? You hear me now? Yeah. Plug up your right ear. What'd you have for breakfast this morning? Breakfast? Mm hmm. Cheerios. Good. Yeah, you can take your finger out now. Are cool. you gonna start crying? You start no, crying I'd be okay. Crying. But it, it's a pretty cool moment. It, it, it is. is. It's a cool moment. I might start crying. Stop, you are gonna start crying. It's okay, she loves you. Stop, mom. She Wait. loves you. Listen, I've been known to cry sometimes when people do this. See, now you're going to bring it on to me. I'm sorry. sorry. Stop. God, you are too much. Hearing myself talk is weird. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I ain't like those kids who like don't have hearing at all. You're not. But that doesn't mean we can't all be happy about this, okay? Are you so. kidding me? This is three years. You've ignored us for how old? For three years now. Well, some of that she might continue to do. You know, I know her. But, you know, the point of it is is to give her more awareness of sound on that side. Yeah. One of the biggest concerns with, you know, our hearing loss is like this is safety because you can't tell where sound is coming from. Exactly. Yeah. So, to me, that's just as big an issue as just making sure you can hear over there. Um, am I sounding comfortably loud? Too loud? Okay. No, I can hear you. Okay. Is it too loud? Okay, because this is kind of on a beginning setting. We're not going to pump it all the way up till we get you used to it yeah. a little bit because we don't want to overwhelm your brain mm -hmm. or your ear. That's why I tell my boss. Okay. Turn that way. I love you. Did you hear that? No. Did okay. you say something? I whispered. Well. I thought maybe she'd be able to hear it. I was going to get excited even more. <laughs> well, try saying it just a little bit loud. Just a little bit louder. I love you. 
I love you too. See, all you did was give yourself just a little more voice. Yeah. She, that's still a whisper. <sighs> it's like there's a speaker in my ear. Mm-hmm. Oh. Yes, there is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Stop crying. I can't. Let her, let her be. Y'all, I can hear. She's just, it's a good day. It's wonderful. Mm-hmm. I mean, at least I fixed one of my flaws. <laughs> you crack me up, girl. I'm going to work on everything else. <laughs> I, mean, I mean, that's a work in progress forever. You know, I think I get some fixed and then I develop other ones. No, Chelsea just passes her on to other people. It may sound like it's going to cut off right now, but don't worry about it, okay? You heard I that? Told you it was it's playing on. music. Now it's coming back on. It's playing music. Mm-hmm. It plays a little chime when it powers back up. Oh my gosh! <laughs> it's very pleasant though, um, and the the idea there is so that when you turn the hearing aid on, you're gonna for sure know it's on because you'll hear that. Yeah. And then you'll hear a beeping sound when you need to change the batteries. Okay. And when it's it's kind of repetitive, you're gonna know what you need to do. Okay. Put the tools in Don't it. think you're in a car <laughs> and that you need to put your seatbelt on. Oh, or my gas is running out. She'll be sleeping and hear this. She'll be late. She'll take a nap and hear a beep and she'll be like, yeah. <laughs> Look, you got a little gift. A little gift carrier. Your oh, look. All right. Everything that I'm going to go over with you now is written down in here. So don't worry. You'll remember it and you have something to...